walks up to me one day. He says, I've got three cards here. I'm going to give you a chance to win some money. Two of the cards are red. And one of the cards is blue. The blue card is the money card. If you can follow the blue card after I mix the three up, you win a dollar. If you can't, you owe me a dollar. So I gave it a shot. I said, well, that's easy. It's on the bottom. And he said, you owe me a dollar. I said, well, there's only three cards. I have a 50-50 chance, uh, so I'm going to say it's on the top. And he said, sorry, buddy. You owe me a dollar. And I said, well, if it's not on the top and it's not on the bottom, then it has to be in the middle. And he said, sorry, you owe me a dollar. Something looked fishy, so I said, uh, I don't think you're playing with any blue cards at all. And he said, no, nope, you owe me a dollar. I said, well, if it's on the bottom, it can't be on the top. I mean, and he said, no, you owe me a dollar. And then again, I said, well, if it's on the top and the bottom, it can't be in the middle. And he said, no, you owe me a dollar. Finally, I said, well, you've got to be playing with more than three cards. And he said, no, just three, you owe me a dollar. About that point, I'd lost $7, and I decided to quit, and he said, wait a minute, I'll give you one more chance. If you, if you can tell me the color of the card that's left in my hand, you owe me nothing. If you can't, you owe me double. I said, with my luck, it's probably both red and blue. And he said, you owe me $14.